I should head to St. Clarity first. These strange ruins seem similar to those near Nareen. Christopher? Now look who's acting strange. Leave me alone. I've just been missing my mother's food, that's all. We are not here to sample the cuisine. We should go to the cathedral to see if we can get Crispell's powers back. Christopher, you're a local, right? Show us the way to the cathedral. Lead the way. We'll follow the sound of your stomach rumbling. In a bit. I need to take care of something first. I'm sorry. I'll catch up with you later. This is so much fun! Isn't that dangerous? Mm, yeah, but it's the only fun thing in town! Somebody is going to be us. But I don't have my time powers. I don't think I can help. Powers or not, you can still guide the future. Everything we do today determines what is to come. Maestro, you're right. Let's go. away by those currents oh dear and and that's all you can say and not my problem i don't get paid to deal with stuff like that so no thank you you're not going to help us <laughs> no go look for someone that gives a damn At least I don't have to go up Mount Thysia anymore. Likely just become another statistic. You've been doing what? Why aren't you with Mom? Excuse me? I've been spending all my time trying to make Floodside livable, and you think you can just... Christopher! What? Not now, guys. I'm in the middle of something. It's no use. He's not listening to us. We'll have to do this without his help. with that old... Oh, who am I kidding? No amount of work can turn these rags into a real gown. Floodside is rough, but having family and friends makes it worthwhile. Don't tell me my son is still out there playing in the flood water. Should we tell her? There's no need to cause her undue worry. Let's just save that child. Quickly! We'll save you! <laughs> 
Thanks for the help, miss. You too, mister. I'm sorry we didn't get to you earlier. I was powerless. Enough. Do you hear yourself right now, Crispo? But, Maestro, if I had my powers... Even with your powers, you can't expect to make everyone happy. What's important is that we choose to do the right thing for those that need our help. I guess you're right. You did the right thing, Crispel. You changed the future for the better. Uh, Mister! Miss! Oh, right. Sorry. Let's get you back to your mom. Mario, are you okay? Thank you for saving him. We're glad to be able to help. Mom, I don't feel so good. Amigo, let's get some soup in you before you catch your death. You'll be better in no time. I think I must have eaten something bad, though. I don't feel so good. Thanks for your help, Mia. Mario will be better in no time. Maybe now would be a good time to track down our would-be warrior, Christopher. Hey, it's you again. Did you rescue that kid? Yes, we did. No thanks to you. Like I said, ain't my job. <laughs> Why aren't you with Mom? Christopher! What do you guys want? Well... We were hoping for some help. Although I guess we've managed to get by so far. Wait, wasn't this place flooded before? What's going on? A boy, Mario, got swept away by the waters. We had to fight a monster to save him! I... I'm sorry. You needed me, and I wasn't there to help. I let you down. Christopher? What happened? Who are these people? Nothing, Dad. These are my friends. Chris Bell and Wilhelm. They're from Nareem. Oh, it's a pleasure, kids. The name's Armando. Are you refugees from Nareem? I've heard... No, sir. We're only travelers looking for the cathedral here in the city. Sorry. I just got so wrapped up in this. The cathedral is inside the walled city. The area of town up those steps to the north. But they don't let just anyone up there. You need a special crest to enter the city. Lucky for us, I happen to have one. Let's go. Are you going to speak to your mother? This isn't about mom or you. Crispell has important business here. I'm going to help her. Of course. Well, if you do see your mother, tell her... Oh, never mind. Of course. Tired. Need s somewhere to crash? Just 50 marbles g gets you each a bed where you can sleep easy. No, thank you. If you change, change your mind. We're always here.
seed could be planted here. Yes, need anything? Yes, we're going to the walled city. I'm Christopher, Sophia's son. That crest, you... I mean, please go ahead, sir. Yes, need anything? Yes, we're going to the... That... to grow up here, Christopher. It was. My brother and I got up to all kinds of trouble. Someone should inform these people that there's a war going on. They know. St. Clarity has sent plenty of soldiers to fight, including my brother. He died protecting Crystallis, you know. Yes, I know. There were a great many sacrifices that day. Thanks to those brave souls, the city still stands. For now. Shall we focus for a moment? We should find the cathedral before some new dire fate befalls us. Hey, wait a second. Is that Christopher? Audrey, are you taking apart grandfather clocks? Everyone, this is Audrey, an incredible inventor and a good friend. It's a pleasure to meet you, Miss Audrey. I'm Chris Bell. Chris and Chris, huh? Well, I don't actually work on clocks, although it's a perfectly respectable profession. I build mechanical creatures that are powered by the rubies. A lot of them are based on things I learned by studying the nearby ruins. A magical automaton? It sounds like something out of an ancient legend. The energy in rubies is certainly plentiful enough. I suppose it was only a matter of time until someone figured out how to advance the science. Well, I was advancing until Enzo slashed my budget. Don't tell me that prick has worked his way into the ruby business. Oh well, I don't even want to tell you the rest. He's up at the courthouse doing all kinds of business. He sounds unpleasant, but he is an important person here. Perhaps we should speak with him anyways. Before that, don't forget, we still need to find the cathedral. Oh, that's right. It's a straight line to the west. You can't miss it. Thanks for the help, Miss Audrey. We're off then. Hey, are you... a crystal mage? Don't ask how I can tell. It's a long story. I'm not a mage myself, but thanks to these robots helping out, one day anyone will be able to have magic on their side. Do you think robots will replace humans? Goodness, no! I just want to help people finish their mundane task more quickly so they can enjoy their lives. Back off! I'm just trying to make a living here! Is the general against that, too? Aren't you from Bloodside? How did you even get up here? You heard, General Enzo. You know you aren't allowed to play here. You're not from St. Clarity, right? Yeah? Excuse me? No need to! Welcome to my store. Have a free souvenir as part of my new client program, Meow. Yeah? But 
but we haven't bought anything yet. No need to thank me. It's a special present just for you. Meow. about Crystallis. They have crazy strong weaponry that no other kingdom can equal, Meow. At least, that's what my sister told me. I'd love to go there one day, Meow. <sighs> Too bad I can't leave my store alone, Meow. You're in the Wildcat Armory! No need to go here right now. I have more important things to do. I just found out I can do magic. Cool, huh? You wouldn't even believe the things I'm learning at the university over in Tulira. Go on, test my knowledge. How do you defeat a mechanical enemy? Easy. You use lightning on them. They might even get stunned. And you can make them even more vulnerable to lightning by preparing them with the water blast. Thank you. I've learned a lot. I just found out I... You wouldn't even believe the things I'm learning at the universe. What's a good way to deal with slimes? Depends on the type of slime and its color, but the ones near Mount Thesi are weak against lightning. I've heard that there are slimes that became contaminated and turned poisonous. Those are really weak against water. Thank you. I've learned a lot. I just found out you wouldn't even believe the well. How do you deal with an armored opponent? That one's easy. Heavily armored opponents are usually vulnerable to more indirect methods of attack, like poison. Thank you. I've learned a lot. I just found that cool. You wouldn't even believe... Well? How do I figure out an enemy's weakness? I remember they said something in class about a scan you, Chandra. Apparently, one can be used to scan a single enemy, but after they are planted, they can scan a bunch! Thank you. I've learned a lot. I did You wouldn't even believe the things I'm learning. Well? Is there anything else we should watch out for? Well, there are rumors about a monster in the sewers, but no two of them are the same. I suppose if it's some kind of sludge monster, it should be weak to fire. I've heard that those kinds of monsters sometimes coalesce around magic pearls. It would be so interesting to be able to look into the past and see how that happened. Thank you. I've learned a lot. Matthias, there's something wrong. I don't feel anything special here. Agreed. If anything, this place feels somewhat... dangerous. That is indeed strange. And who is that fellow? Was there not supposed to be a Mother Superior here? Right. But 
I don't see her. Was there perhaps a different cathedral here once? This is the same cathedral I grew up with, except they changed the stained glass. Why change yourselves when you can just change the faith that condemns you? What? Never mind. Perhaps the fact that the mural is missing has something to do with Crispell not feeling a connection. So what are we going to do now? We need to figure out what happened here. Someone must know something. Let's try speaking with the priest. I am Father Miguel, the Lady's humble disciple. I see that you are not members of my congregation. How can I help you? I know this might seem like a strange question, but have there been any renovations to this cathedral in recent years? We do have small renovations from time to time, but nothing major has changed in years. I see. Um, why do those murals show a crowning? I recognize the lady, but who is the other person? The man receiving the crown. I wonder how much he looks like the guy who paid for this installation. I know all about the regular doctrine. But here in St. Clarity, we believe that the people who take care of us are the lady's hands in this world. Is that why you changed out the stained glass? Oh, that was years ago. I doubt many people even remember the old one. Do you happen to know what happened to the old glass mural they removed? I wouldn't know. But perhaps General Enzo, the leader of the city, might remember. He was the one who ordered it. If my mind doesn't fail me, he should be in the courthouse of the city. As always, he's looking for the progress of our dear St. Clarity. All right. Thank you for your help, Father. Of course, my child. May the lady watch over you in your search. May the benevolent lady watch over all of you, my children. Shall we make a record of our adventure? Nothing for now. People in Floodside think they're the only ones who have it bad. I've got a leak in my roof. Imagine. Oh, yes, that's dreadful. Can I? Help you? No, you can't. Well, I can't let just anyone in, you see. You must be new. I'm Christopher. I'm guessing my mother left instructions to let me pass if I ever showed up again. Ah, indeed she did. She's talking with the general just now, but I'm sure she will be free soon. I will tell her that you are here. And so, we aim to move from a four times increase in output this season to as much as five or six times a normal yield before the winter. But if I were you, I would place an order now. Supplies of rubies might be going up, but not as fast as the demand for them is. What the people demand is justice! Oh no, Dad, not again. What is going on? My dad, he does this sort of thing, stirring up trouble, constantly campaigning against inequality in the city. You sit up here living in luxury while those who mind the rubies live in squalor. How did he get here? Someone, escort this instigator out, please. Yeah, 
And not only that, you've been monopolizing our resources. Ugh, now the inventor girl is here too? This has gone too far, Armando. You've crossed the line. Guards, take these rabble-rousers out. Wait, you seem familiar. Aren't you? Do less talking and more listening, Risa. This is how a leader leads. Look how he's convinced the whole room to buy from him. I'm paying attention, Aunt Rollis. I swear. I'm paying... Who might you be? Sophia's son, if you really need to know. Hmm, I suppose I can see the resemblance. You don't really take after the general, though. Of course I don't look like the general. Why would I... Oh, no. Not him. Um... I hate to be kept waiting like this, but the demand for red crystals is so high these days. Hmm? Where do you come in from? We just arrived from Nareem. Ah, uh, well, you might be out of luck then. You can't get a meeting with him unless he thinks you come from a rich province. Can't you see I- Get your hands off me! You heard General Enzo. You have to leave immediately. Hey! Take your hands off of Armando! Get your hands- where do you think you're going, huh? No one is allowed near General Enzo. Christopher, you're home! I was afraid you'd never come back. Guards, stand down. Oh, uh, terribly sorry, ma'am. Please go ahead, Mr. Christopher, sir. What finally brings you back home, dear? It wasn't really a planned thing. Won't you introduce us to your friends? It's complicated. They're, um, time mages. Excuse me, miss, but you have a beautiful home. It reminds me of my own village. Only grander. Thank you. We've been very fortunate. Now that we've modernized the production of rubies, all of St. Clarity has been thriving. Well, Floodside doesn't really seem like it's thriving. It will just take time. Eventually the prosperity will reach everyone. And I would think so-called Time Mages would be able to see that future for themselves. What are you doing with this guy? All the people you could pick. You might be Sophia's son, but I'll thank you to treat me with respect. Yeah, okay. Look, we just want to know what happened to the stained glass mural that got removed from the cathedral. The priest said you were the one who ordered it. Just tell us where it is, and I promise you can go crawl back under your dung heap. I see you inherited your father's low-class irreverence. Unlike him, most hard-working citizens look up to me. They pretty much have to, since you live up here on a walled-in hill. Christopher, please, enough of this. I know the mural you're talking about. It was dumped in the waters by the docks years ago, along with other trash from the cathedral. Come on, Chris Bell, let's go find it. We're done here. Crisbell, what do you want to do? I want to record our progress. What do you think that is out there? It's an ancient titan. One of the witnesses. 
Scholars say they're meant to remind us that the lady is always watching. It looks like one of my grumpy aunts. Look, something's happening to it. It appears we have been invited to enter. What do you think could be inside? Only one way to find out. Oh, who is it this time? It's been ages since I've had a visitor. And the last ones were a little more than thieves. Who? Ah, hello, darling. You must be a... Oh, how interesting. Hmm, hmm, hmm. You didn't answer my question. Oh, sorry. I was admiring... Well, never mind. Well, hello. I am Paulina, witness of the ages. Ah, oh, it feels good to be able to move again. My first love is fashion, but I'm always interested in talking to a time mage. Especially one who recently lost her powers. Would you care to explain how you knew that? <laughs> I see your shorts match your fuse. Just because I look this good doesn't mean I can't also be good at what I do. I don't suppose you could help us figure out what to do about Crispel's powers, could you? Oh, yes, yes. Well, I won't be doing much of anything. It will be on you to remedy that situation. Just step over to the altar. I feel... something. But I don't know if... You! What are you doing here? Just when Crispel doesn't have her pat. Ouch! Christopher! How could you be so careless? Ah, did you hear this, Quad? I think he really believes he'll beat us twice. Too bad we can only kill him once. Maybe her grace will let us rewind him a few times. For sport. Everyone listen! We need to focus on inflicting as much indirect damage as we can. Now! Oh, that's very cute! Strategize all you want, we'll still pound you to smithereens. <laughs> this will be interesting. I do hope you all at least put on a good show. without being overconfident, don't you?
the power of the cathedral. But how? Whatever it is you felt before, you need to find that again. Hurry! Everything around here? That kid with the big mouth. I'm sure you can feel something inside you. Is she talking about me? Focus inside. And while you do that, think of the girl with the tragic fashion sense. You do the same, girl, except you think of the kid with the regrettably tacky goggles. Uh, I'm trying. While you two try to connect, let me explain how this works. As you fight, you'll gather energy. Synchro points, if you will. When you have enough energy, you'll be able to activate a powerful synchronization skill. You can trigger it by just pressing the button. Now, Crispel, use the crystals. This is so unfair! Ugh. Quickly, back to the Empress. Impressive. Synchros are powerful abilities that can turn the tide of battle around. Always keep an eye on it and your friends, since you'll also be able to use this power on their turns. Don't forget to plan ahead. Remember that you don't lose stored synchro points after you finish a battle. The crystals! I have their power again! But that connection... What was that? I don't really know how it happened. Now we know that you're the real thing, darling. You just proved you have the power to link with those close to you. This seems like an incredible power. But be careful, and take it slowly. I can feel it. I can feel your presence. All of you. I can feel it too. Does this mean we're combining our powers? Sinking would be more precise. We are using our powers in a more unified way. This seems to connect all of us, but only through Crispel. A great discovery indeed. It could have happened in a less dangerous way though. Don't be so melodramatic. This is a holy place. You were never in any real danger. So what do we do now? Come on. We should try to rest a little bit. Let's find somewhere back in town. Come back and visit any time. Maybe I can even pick out something that would flatter your figure, darling. I've always wondered if my calling in life was to design beautiful garments. Even after all that has happened, I'm glad that you came back home. Chris Bell. Mom? What are you doing out here? I have a favor to ask. Aren't you in a relationship with the most powerful man in the city? Why not ask him? It's... Not that simple. When Enzo came to power, he did a lot for the economy of the city. He found investors who helped us modernize the production of the rubies. What are these rubies? They're what you get when you fuse together a lot of red crystal dust. The dust exists as a trace mineral in many things, and it has magical properties. It has many uses in magic devices, and can even be used to create armor and weapons. That's why rubies are so valuable. We've been exporting more of them than ever before. But there are things about the operation that Enzo has been hiding, even from me. One of the teams of workers that went up Mount Thysia never came back. 
The official story is that they were delayed by a rock slide, but I know it's not true. And now the people in Floodside are starting to notice. I'd like for you to investigate. I'm home for one day and you're already sending me away again? No, I just... I saw that fight you just had, and... You and your friends are the only ones I know who don't work for Enzo. And you, Crispel, really are a time mage. Please, use your powers to find out what happened to the missing workers. I'll do it. Thank you. Come and see me privately afterwards. Please be careful, Christopher. Don't worry, Mom. I'm not a kid anymore. Crispel, what do you want to do? I want to record our progress. 